People think you can go like a supermarket, go into a supermarket and I'm going to go and buy rice and I just go to the section where they're selling rice and I get rice. Acting is not like that. We're not teaching you theater acting. You need to know where the camera is. I see a habit that's going to take you a while to get rid of. He's looking for his mark. So you see why it starts getting difficult? Sit on your hand. You've got to train yourself to stop doing that. Three, two, one. When we were doing the piece to the head, it wasn't me. Stop. One of the young actors found it very difficult. I see a habit that's going to take you a while to get rid of. To follow instructions. Come in. Stand. Sit on your hands. Okay. It wasn't me. And then you go from there. Okay. So basically your, your acting is here. Mm. It's your eyes. It's not this. You're going to find it quite difficult because I can see it's something that you've done a lot. So what they told me was I had to sit. And so if you saw the technique I yeah, used, yeah. I held my hand. My problem is this. If you've noticed, I speak with my eyes a lot. So when they give me the close, give me a close-up. Camera, close-up. Go close, go close, go close. When I start doing like this, eh? it's too much. It's like I'm shouting. So I have to sit on my eyes. I communicate with my eyes, but I have to tone them down when I'm in a tight close-up. It's too loud. It's too much in a close-up. Can you see it? So it's the same. Look, if I start doing like this, it, it's as if I'm shouting. But that's what I normally do. So if I'm doing that kind of scene, I have to keep reminding myself, Ashik Neo, Ashik Neo, don't do that to me. Just, then it's like, okay. It's the same thing with you, with okay, the habit. Sir. Yes, sir. So you're gonna have to learn how to be still and focus. If you're noticing, something about laughter is when we get uncomfortable, we tend to, <laughs> we tend to giggle and laugh. The habits I was telling you about, You've got to train yourself to stop doing that. Meanwhile, I still have to do my job. We're not teaching you theatre acting, to be or not to be, yeah? We're teaching you screen acting. It's all about the screen. It's all about the camera. As an actor, you need to know where the camera is. So you over there, she's masking you. Come into, so basically wherever you're looking, like you, I, if, I'm, if I'm the camera here, you need to move a bit to the left, a bit to the right. That's what I'm just trying to get you to understand, especially when you're doing scenes, yeah? If I was the camera now, this part of, this part of your face is gone. I'm only seeing Ruth. You over there, you're completely gone. So always remember, look for where the lens is and move yourself slightly so that the lens can see. It could be a crowd, yeah? But find the gap. Cameras. When you are not saying your lines, you will discover if you're a good actor, they stay on you because you're listening and you're, and you're reacting. And editors love that. The DOP has told me, oh, it's a close-up. What does that mean? It means I can't move around. I've got to be steady and I've got to also tell my story. Let me move like that. You come out of the camera. Edge of frame. You always ask, where's the edge of frame? Am I in your frame? When am I out? Edge of frame. Don't pass here. Yeah? We're trying to get you like this. Mm. So that one, two, three, four. Yeah? Mm. So that the camera sees all four of you. I know it's not it's not natural. Yeah? But for us, so you'll be here, she'll be here, and the man will be here. 
We don't do natural. Come. We don't do natural. Look, look at how much difference it makes. If you go out there, yeah, it, it's too far. Look at the camera. Come closer. Come closer, each of you. Come a little bit. You see what I'm saying? Yeah? yeah. It doesn't feel... Natural. Is this... You know, you feel uncomfortable, yeah? Yes. You're in each other's space. But the director wants you because you're friends. No. Yeah? We're not friends. Okay, whatever you are, you're, you're, you're acting. You <laughs> yeah, understand? Okay. So, if you're not friends, then come back a little, but just be aware. I know what you're doing. He's looking for his mark. Yeah? But the camera's seen it. He's seen. So sometimes you must be able to hit your mark without doing this. Look at it from here. See, I'm looking at the mark here. Yeah? I'm already, I've clocked, see as I looked at it, yeah? We don't want that. So even when from here now, be looking at your mark, get an idea where it is, hit it. Director will say to you, okay, first mark, and then uh, go to your second mark, and then go to your third mark. They are all positions on the floor. So, first mark, second mark, third mark, and the reason is the director of photography will light you for that first mark. They will light you for the second mark, and they will light you for the third mark. That's the gaffer. You have the lights, you have the cameras, you have the directors, you have the instructor, you have the script. And you've got to remember your mark. You've got to, by the way, what shot are we in? These are technical aspects of screen acting. So on all these technical aspects, you still have to do what? Act. Do you know something about when they're introducing characters for the first time in the script, that's the only time you see them in capital letter. After that, they're in normal writing. Mm -hmm. So anytime you see capital letters on your script, it means that they are introducing that character for the first time. After they've introduced that character for the first time, it's supposed to go back to normal, capital C, small a, U, K, S. Have you heard of eights, anybody? A scene is one page is divided into eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, I've got this page, and what eight? is Danjima is talking about grass. Let me see. Page 11. Where's the grass? Four eighths. So if you want me to know where it is on the script, instead of saying halfway down the page, sir, just say four eighths. And I know it's halfway. You see what I'm saying? And then so when they say your scene is two and three eighths, it means that two pages and one, two, three, the scene ends, your scene ends there. Three eighths of a page. That's how we do pages in production and post production and everything, yeah? Tongues will wag. Gossiping about other students is what uni students do best. So when you say lecturer, bracket OS, what does OS mean? Off sound, off shoot. Off screen. Off screen. Off screen. Yeah? Me off shoot there. So it means that <laughs> the director is probably like this, and we're hearing the lecturer, but we're not seeing the lecturer anymore, yeah? Yes. Off screen, yeah? Everybody has a role. Everybody knows their role. But whenever there's an issue, the production manager is there to relieve the producer. Sometimes the production manager hardly comes to the set. He's the one making sure that, where's the camera truck? Have you hired the, where's the camera now? What's happening to the food? Why is the food not here? Uh -uh, this actor has called that she's not coming. Have you told the director who, wait, why? What do you mean, they only, you only ordered five rooms and there are 20 of us? What do you mean? He has to sort that shit out. He's logistic. But you have a line producer as well. There are lots of producers. You have the assistant producer, you have the associate producer. The cameraman is under the director of photography. Let's not go into all of this, we'll be here till tomorrow. <laughs>